You suck at building. I mean, that's suggested by the fact that you're watching this video in the first place. So if you really do suck, I can help you get better. And by the end of this video, you should be able to build some pretty cool things. Okay, the first thing you need to know about is probably texturing. This involves scattering various different blocks together. Never leave anything plain, instead add different blocks to your build that might help make it more interesting. And this certainly doesn't just apply for little platforms on the floor. This will work in whatever you're building. And this is just stage one, it looks so much better. My favourite way to add lighting to any build is with lanterns and chains. I also like to alternate the height of the lanterns to give the build some more variation. Of course there are different lighting methods that work with other builds, but my personal favourite is lanterns. Adding sections to your build can make it so much better with like no effort at all. My favourite ways to do this include pillars, buttons and fence gates but this can be accomplished in many different ways. These are the three main factors of building a good building, but there are so many more tips, so what better way to show this than building an actual house? I'm gonna scatter different blocks around the build, but I'm gonna add lighter ones at the top and darker ones at the bottom to make a gradient. Moss can make anything that has a stone, cobblestone and stone brick texture look so much better. Mossy cobble and mossy stone bricks can be used to blend in the moss. This creates a nice contrast between the regular grey colour. For roofing, I usually just use the wood type associated with the build and a mixture of stairs and slabs. There are many different styles you could go for and the roof doesn't need to be anything crazy. To be honest, depth is one of the most important parts of building. Using techniques like stairs below windows and things sticking out from the build is a great way to add depth. I also like to add a balcony on my builds to add even more depth. Now utilising the techniques that I mentioned before, I can add really good lighting. The floor of your building can be anything really, but I like to choose something that contrasts with the outside, like wood in this case. To travel between floors, I usually like to use stairs, but in small confined places like this, I usually like to use ladders. When our building is complete with furnishings, it really looks incredible. I also like to design custom trees for my build, because normal trees are... questionable. Using a mix of different blocks, I made a cool cherry tree, so use it in your next build. Thanks for watching and subscribe to see more videos like this. If you want to show me your buildings, post them on my Discord, link below.